Aloha. It's a good way to end the night with some aloha in the house, right? There's not much more that can be said that hasn't already been said. Uh, I feel truly undeserving to stand on this stage tonight after we've seen such incredible champions who I know have inspired us all to look in the mirror uh, in our own lives to see how we can better take action for the well-being of others. You know, when we come here tonight celebrating shared values, we've heard a lot about freedom, the importance of security, and this most basic desire for peace, for our families and our communities and our home to be safe. No one understands peace more than those who've experienced and seen war firsthand. And we understand that freedom is not free. We understand the incredibly high cost of war and how many people have and continue to sacrifice tremendously for this freedom. So the commitment that I am leaving this night with, and I know we all are, is this commitment that we will continue to str stand strong and boldly for these freedoms, freedom of security, freedom of religion, freedom of speech, freedom of the press, to stand strong with our friend, ally, and partner, Israel, stand against oppression, persecution, and genocide of religious minorities around the world, and to challenge ourselves in this time of divisiveness to find that which unites us, and to celebrate that, and to stay focused on what our mission is collectively, the well-being of our people together in the future. Thank you very much. Aloha.